My name is Sheila Pony. I work for City Review newspaper. Sheila. Yes. Uh, City wonder, Review. Uh, yes. My question is regarding the SSPDF that uh, is set to is set to Congo. Congo. Uh, we didn't know how much money was what budget the budget of the, the forces for going there, and also how comes that they ended up uh, in Western Equatoria uh, mm. without having nationality IDs. Mm. Uh, yeah, how comes they just started the journey without such an important? Sheila. Uh, regarding the force in, that is going to Congo, I was told that a budget was provided and released by the national parliament. I do not know how much money was budgeted for a release, but at least something was released, and uh, that's why they were able to be equipped, to be given some logistics and other equipment that we had seen on the day they graduated and and left. Why they found themselves in Western Equatoria? We are going to have two bases. We are going to have an operational base in Western Equatoria, or logistical base in Western Equatoria. And then we have operational base in Goma, where they will be deployed. So it is like we'll be moving from our base here within the Republic of South Sudan then we go to the forward base in Goma, in Eastern DRC. That's why they went there. And you know Western Equatoria is bordering Congo. And that is going to be our next theater of operations. Why they went without the IDs? You know, most of our, our security personnel got deployed in some areas with, with no services, such as the issuing of ID cards. And these forces were drawn from different divisions. Some were brought from 4th Infantry Division, 5th, 3rd, very far. So some of them were not having their IDs, simply because such services were lacking. So when they were brought, it was realized that majority of them were not having the, the relevant documents, age assessment, nationality, and passport. So they were taken to Mundri to process their documents, and I met with the commander after some of you had left my office. The commander came to update me that they have already, around 500, have already received their travel documents and that the process will be completed in the, in the next two days for them to leave. I think I've answered when, you on that. When will they, uh, when will they set to, to go to Congo? You know it will, it will be a process, but we'll update you. In the next two days, if their documents are obtained, then they will embark on going to their um, base in Western Equatoria, but I'll not tell you when will they go for security reasons. And I'll not tell you the route they will be taking. <laughs> okay. There, there were allegations about them stopping to go besides the ID, which you clarified. They said that these forces were supposed to be paid each $1,000. Unfortunately, others received only 500 others 200 And that's why they decided not to go. Maybe you can also make it clear to the public and uh, we also had that the, some of the vehicles got accidents and the, the weapons poured down or something like that from the rumors so maybe it's good that you make it clear uh, regarding that allegation Dr. Kudip, they did not even receive even a, a penny okay. uh, they have not been paid an, anything leave alone rejecting $500 Quiz? So that one is uh, the propaganda. I think it emerged from uh, an F uh, FM radio somewhere in Congo. I think women got in Shoshu, got in Shoshu mission. Yeah, and they are feeling, maybe some of them are feeling that Lena DJ Sad Nina. So yeah, they are women Shoshu now, it is not true. Uh, no money was given, maximum 1,000, and then they were given 500. It is true. Two vehicles were involved in accident after they departed here. But there was no substantial damage done. Nobody was hurt. The vehicles have been fixed. And their, uh, the payment is being, is being worked out.
it is true, the two vehicles were. That, but there was no damage to, to the vehicles and to, to any guns. But there is plan to pay the, the, these soldiers who have gone? Is there a plan to pay for Of course, the, the, we get paid like any other public servants. But I do not know about the pay structure. My pay structure, our pay structure, we know. I get 15,800 pounds per month. I don't know about the pay structure. Uh, let us go to Fidel. Regarding myself, my physical body for 